Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Mega Park. I want to start this video by thanking you for the huge support the channel has been getting even though I have kind of had a burnout in terms of inspiration and planet coaster. After the mini park I kind of just was completely blank, no ideas, no inspiration, no drive to, to get me going. I just said I, I took too much on my plate and that kind of showed the last few months. But even though I did not upload anything, the Blackborough showcase video got by now probably 1.2k views, which is by far the most any of my videos I've ever gotten. It's beaten the second place by like five times. So I want to give a huge thank you for everyone who has watched it and just in general for the support. Uh, now with all that being out of the way, uh, I want to talk about something huge that is coming really soon, as in next episode. I've been working on this huge project. This uh, It's gonna be a dark ride, I can tell you that. And I can even tell you that it's gonna be one of those motion arms, I believe they're called Remotion in game. Basically the same ride technique that is used in Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey at the Universal Parks. And ever since I have been there in 2016, I have basically been obsessed with this ride type. So I've always really wanted to make some dark ride type idea with this, but I just never knew about what. I once started like two years ago with a Batman themed right with this remotion uh, style but I never got past the first scene but I can tell you already like by the time this goes out I am practically done with this ride already I've kind of built up a backlog so that there's never gonna be like this big gap in my videos again so this project it's gonna be in more of a fantasy type style as in at least from the outside appearing which brings me to the facade which is the best building I've ever built in my life in Planet Coaster there's nothing that competes with it to give you a little bit of perspective Blyboro in total has 160,000 pieces, which is a bunch. But the biggest building in the entire city only has about four to 5,000. This facade I've built is 27,000 pieces big and it's only the facade. There's no queue, nothing inside the right that also contributes to this piece count. So it, it's gonna be huge. I'm, I'm so proud. It's just unbelievable how good it's looking. And just watching that next episode, just, just trust me, it's gonna be amazing. It, it looks so good. But that does bring me to the next point, and that is what I'm working on right now, the big entrance plaza. So I basically only built the right side of it, which is a little, uh, well, it looked a little empty. So last episode I constructed the gatehouse, and well, that was already like, okay, this, this is making an improvement, so I wanted to also do something on the left side. In the same time period, I also found an image online of some uh, fantasy style buildings, and I was like, ooh, those look really good, but it's really hard to make in Planet Coast because it was all those organic shapes and planet coaster is good in all right angles or perfect circles no organic uh, types of weird looking wiggly roofs so what I basically did for this tower that I will be building in this episode I basically grabbed that tower from one of the of the buildings and just built it and was just kind of like I'm I'm just gonna see where this is going because you know who knows maybe it maybe it's nice on its own I never expected the result to look this good I am absolutely, I, when I was done with this tower, I was just blown away, absolutely in love. And also the little gate next to it. Uh, and that, actually the little gate that inspired me to something, or at least, well, it looks like on the time lapse I built the car right first and then the gate, but actually it was like my plan to build this fantasy style gate, which I eventually did. And then I was like, what am I going to have through there? And of course, by now you know, it's this classic car ride. And basically, this car ride is just, I don't know, it, it, it was just like in such, some sort of moment of inspiration, I guess you could say. It was uh, not, not something I had planned on months in advance or anything. It was just like, yeah, that would be cool. And so I did it, and now there's a car ride going by the, by the entrance plaza. And I absolutely love it. I mean, it looks a little bland right now, of course, because there's only a small piece of it that, that's themed. But I'm thinking of maybe, you know, making some elven style garden or maybe just a more simple an English style garden. Who knows? I'm not sure yet. Uh, but this uh, that's kind of the idea for the building. So uh, we have the medieval gatehouse and then it shifts over in the buildings from very much just real world, real world medieval until it's at this fantasy style tower that you probably wouldn't find anywhere in the world, maybe in Asia somewhere. It looks like something something you could maybe put somewhere in Asia, but still there it would also stand out. So I'm happy with that. 
And this fantasy style is the style I'm going to be building in for the next few episodes. Like this. Um, or at least I will try like the in the dark ride itself. It's not gonna be as much of you know this, this these weird roofs, which I love by the way. I love the I love the like the little circles and the little I don't even know how to explain it. You know the the, the just the, the roofs you don't see in the real world. And I will be trying to really incorporate this in the main streets. Uh, oh, also something I should probably. Um, probably explain uh, in the back of this footage sometimes you can see a massive dive coaster uh, which also sometimes shifts shape and form and location and that was basically just me experimenting between tapes because I also kind of wanted to make some rideable thing but in the end I just wasn't happy with what I, what I was uh, going, to, going to do so in uh, in real time it's it's already deleted but I'm still looking into the possibility of you know Picking it up again because I did kind of like the life coaster as a weenie, so that that may be coming, but but I haven't even built it in real time, so that won't be coming for the next few episodes. Next few episodes really will be just focused on this dark ride, and I couldn't be more excited. Well, anyway, I will just leave you to it, and well, if you enjoyed this, if you want, well, if you're curious about the dark ride, and you really should be because it's awesome, then well, just leave a like, subscribe. And well, I'll be back with you next week.